Hey there guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am so excited because I am taking you guys shopping with me at the biggest mall in America. It is the Mall of America in Bloomington, Minnesota. We are here on a Saturday before Christmas, so it is so busy. We are parking across from the mall at Ikea and taking the shuttle back. <laughs> Funnest day ever. Are we in the shuttle bus? Oh, here's Dad, Dad's going to miss the bus. Daddy, Daddy, it's Andy. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm going out for sure. <laughs> I just love coming to the mall at Christmas time. They have an outdoor skating rink set up right now and I wish my boys had their skates because I'm sure that they would love to be out here right now. But we are going inside and the boys are going to be going to the amusement park in there and my friend and I are going to be doing some shopping. So I'm going to just take you guys along, show you guys here and there, a little bit through the mall. This mall is absolutely huge, so I highly doubt I'm going to get to everything today. I'm just going to show you a little glimpse of what we are doing throughout our day. Now over here is the Santa area. If you want to visit with Santa, this is where you would go. There are so many beautiful silver trees everywhere. Now the lineup was a little bit longer for this today and the boys were so excited to go on rides with their friends. So we skipped out on this, but I needed to get a little bit of this on video for you guys because it is just so beautiful. You guys want to be in the vlog? No. <laughs> Are you? Yeah. Going in his buddies? Hi, boy. What's up? <laughs> All right, guys, here we are at the amusement park area of the mall. So we are going to get the kids all set up with the dads, and then the moms are going to go do a little bit of shopping. Chandon, are you going to go on rides? Yeah. All right, so the kids are having a blast over at the amusement park right now with the dads. And us moms are gonna hit up a couple of stores. First store I'm gonna stop at is Athleta. Now I'm not gonna show you guys in and out of every single store because it is super busy. So I knew it would take like all day and I only have one day, so I'd like to get some power shopping done. So I'm just gonna show you guys little blimps here and there um, of the stores that we go into. So now we are going into Hollister and Abercrombie. My little guys absolutely love these stores. They love the clothes from there. So I'm gonna see if there's anything in there for Christmas for them. But while I was in there, I found these velour tights for myself. So I thought I would give these guys a try because they were size 15, 16 and they were a good price and I thought they might fit me. So I'm in the fitting room and I'm gonna give these a try. The food places at this mall are so amazing. Like there are so many good restaurants to choose from. It is honestly overwhelming. <laughs> and if you're with a big group of people, um, it's kind of hard to narrow down to one place. But I just thought I'd give you guys a little peek at a few of the restaurants in this little strip here. Now over here we have the Rainforest Cafe, which we've eaten at multiple times, but we won't be going there today because we are going to the Hard Rock instead. And there's also the Crayola Experience, which is great for kids. There's a little Build-A-Bear workshop stand over here, which is super great because sometimes the actual store has long lineups. And this is kind of like a quicker version where you can just pop in, which is a great idea if you're just walking through the mall. And there's the Margaritaville restaurant over there, which I'm sure the dads would love to go sit at. So 
So one of the main reasons we came to the mall today was I wanted to hit up this Five Below store to check out some Christmas presents for the kids. And they have a ton of stuff in here for $5 or less, which is super great. So I'm gonna take you guys through here. Now the first thing that I saw was this table of fluffy pajama pants and matching shirts, which is super great. And for five bucks, you just can't go wrong. This store had no shortage of arts and crafts supplies. There were so many different things to choose from. So I'm just gonna kinda show you guys all the different things I found. Who else's kids are crazy about slime making? Mine just loves slime making and there are so, so many different slime kits here. Like there are just, it is endless. So I'm gonna grab a couple of these because I know that my kids will like these for Christmas. And the other thing that the store is really great for is if you have gift exchanges and you have like $10 limits or something like that, you can find some really great gifts here for under $10, even under $5. Like these cute Sherpa fluffy socks are five bucks and they are adorable. There's also a whole bunch of books here that you can choose from. I ended up picking up a couple of these as well. I think the slippers here are a fantastic deal. They have so many cute, cute slippers for the holidays, all sorts of sparkly ones, and they're five bucks. Also, these little press on nails, if you have any little girls who love to do manicures and pedicures and makeup, these are super great stocking ideas. We're just back down here at the amusement park area. We're just gonna meet up with the kids and check on them, see how everybody's doing. So the other thing I really love about the amusement park area in this mall is that they have characters who come out and meet with the kids and you can get pictures. Now we have SpongeBob here and I think the other guy's name is Squishy. <laughs> I can't really remember. But anyhow, they are just so happy to be running into these characters and getting some pictures. It's really cute. Oh, thank you. What do you guys want? Now over here they have a stage with these gorgeous, gorgeous, giant Christmas trees. And they actually have an elementary school here singing some Christmas carols and it was just so beautiful. It is just so cute to see all the little guys up there on stage. One store that I really love to hit up is H&M. I usually find a couple of things here, so I'm just gonna browse around and see if there's anything that I can snag for myself. So 
so I found two really cute shirts the one is this red one and it says oh dear with some sparkles and then the other one is just this plain white t-shirt with little rhinestones all over it I think both of them can be dressed up really nicely for the holidays so I am going to take these All right, so I see a Champs over here and I'm gonna run in there and see if there's anything for my boys that I can grab them for Christmas. As you can see down below, there are so many other stores. I don't know that we will be able to get to these all today, but I'm gonna head into Champs and see what they have. My boys haven't really asked for anything this year, so it's making my decision making really difficult. So. I think I'm just gonna kind of browse today and get a bunch of ideas and then make my list and then power shop and then grab everything that I need to grab. There is a really great deal today on body lotions. I guess it's only the select scents though, but it is still a great deal. Like I said earlier, if you have a gift exchange, that is a really great option because it's only $2.95, so you can definitely make up a couple of nice little gift sets with these lotions. There are also so, so many candles and so many scents to choose from. I have no idea. I'm looking through all of them. I'm in the White Barn store right now, so this is just full of deliciously yummy scented candles and wallflowers for your home. These gift sets are a really nice option for Christmas presents. If you're kind of in a rush and you don't know what to get, a gift set is always a great option. Now my friend and I were trying to figure out like what is the difference between Bath & Body and White Barn. Now I'm pretty sure it's the same company and it seems to be the same products but why do they have a store called White Barn and then why do they have a store called Bath & Body? If anybody knows let me know in the comments below because I don't really know. It is just kind of weird to me but maybe, maybe White Barn is just all home scented stuff but that doesn't make sense because I just saw some hand cream there. I don't know, but if anybody knows, let me know because I'm really curious. You guys, there is the Kendra Scott store. I am obsessed with their stuff. I don't have any jewelry pieces from there, but I really want one. Hint, hint, if anyone's looking, get me something for Christmas. All right, so before we take our shuttle back to the hotel, because the guys actually left already and we stayed behind, so we're taking our shuttle back to the hotel. I wanted to get something to drink because I'm dying of thirst, so I got this yummy bluish chai tea thing. I can't remember what it was, but it was really tasty. And now we're just heading back over to where we catch our shuttle bus. Okay guys, so we are heading out of here. The skating rink is all quiet. Looks like everyone's heading home for the night. I hope you guys enjoyed checking out what we were looking at at the mall today. That mall is a huge, huge place, so I definitely didn't get to nearly like a fraction of the stores that I wanted to show you guys, but at least you guys got a little bit of a peek of how beautiful it looks and what is available at that mall. If you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below and hit the little notification bell so you guys don't miss any of my future videos. Take care, bye.